Manithu Padmanabha Pillai, the 2nd of January 1878 to the 25th of February 1970, was an Indian social reformer and freedom fighter from the southwestern state of Kerala. He is recognized as the founder of the Nair Service Society (NSS), which claims to represent the Nair community that constitutes 12.10% from KMS 2011 of the population of the state. Pamanabhan is considered as a visionary reformer who organized the Nair community under the NSS. Early life Manithu Pamanabhan Pillai was born in Peruna village in Changanasheri, Katiyam district, British India on 2 January 1878 to Iswaran Nambuthiri of Nilavana Ilam and Manithu Parvathi Ama. He began his career as a teacher in 1893 in a government primary school. After a few years, from 1905 he changed his profession and started practicing law, in the magistrate's courts. <laughs> Nair Service Society On 31 October 1914, with the help of a few others, he established the Nair Service Society. His main ambition was to uplift the status of the Nair community. From 1915 onwards, he gave up law practice and became full-time secretary of the Nair Service Society. Manam revived and reshaped the old concept of village societies, the Karayogams, which practically set the tenor of family and village life. In 1924–25 the NSS persuaded the Travancore government to enact the Nair regulation which broke up the matriarchal joint family providing for paternal and maternal property to divide it among all the children. Pamanabhan was involved with the Nair Service Society as its secretary for 31 years and as its president for three years. He was honoured with the title Bharata Kesari by the President of India. He also received Padma Bhushan in 1966. On 2 January 2017, Nair Service Society celebrated the 140th Manam Jayanti at NSS headquarters, Peruna in Changanasari. Political life He fought for social equality, the first phase being the Vaikom Satyagraha, demanding the public roads near the temple at Vaikom be opened to low caste Hindus. In 1924, he took part in the Vaikom and Guruvayur temple entry satyagrahas and anti-untouchability agitation. He opened his family temple for everyone, irrespective of caste distinction he became a member of the Kerala Congress in 1964 and took part in the agitation against Sir C. P. Ramaswamy Iyer's administration in Travancore. As the first president of Travancore Devaswam board, he revitalized many temples which had almost ceased to function. In 1949, Pamanabhan became a member of the Travancore Legislative Assembly. In 1959, he, along with Christian churches, led a united opposition against the state communist ministry, which became known as the Vimachana Samaram. Liberation struggle. The cause of the Vimachana Samaram was the introduction of an education bill by the Minister of Education, Joseph Mundasari, and the movement caused the dismissal of the communist government under EMS Nambudaripad on 31 July 1959. After the success of the movement he famously tethered a white horse at the Kerala Secretariat building as he had challenged to do if the dismissal was successful. The consequence of the dismissal was the beginning of President's rule in the state under Article 356 of the Indian Constitution. In 1964 he was instrumental in the formation of Kerala Congress, the first regional party in India. <laughs> Death Pamanabhan died on 25 February 1970 at the age of 92, after age-related complications. Manam Memorial or Samadhi is located at NSS headquarters Changanasheri. He is regarded as the reformer and moral guide of Nairs. See also Mahatma Gandhi College Manam Memorial NS. S. College Nair Service Society MMNSS College Khatiyam Notes <laughs>